Hello everybody. Today we're gonna learn about the simple lesson. I am gonna be your teacher today and my name is Brian, I mean Tom. So today's vocabulary is about jobs. These are jobs. We have jobs and the words are teacher. Let me get my marker. Teacher, doctor, vet, cook, fireman, baker, singer, painter, butcher, dentist, astronaut, waiter, barber or hairdresser, policeman, artist, builder, dance and dancer. Those are the words. So I will also gonna explain you what do those words mean like and how to ask people for your jobs like so they could answer you not too rude not too polite or not too crazy not too stupid not too anything but medium a little rude and a little nice so the f now i'm gonna tell you how to first i'm gonna tell you how to ask people for their jobs the first the first question the first um the first question you can ask about job is what is your job what is your job what is your job are you a doctor a vet a cook or a fireman what is your job maybe you can be a baker you are a baker now but then you can also ask what would you like to be in the future what would you like to be in the future my dream in the future is i'm gonna be an astronaut this is an astronaut an astronaut is a person who explores space but we're got, not gonna talk about it we're just gonna we're, the first part we're gonna only talk about how we ask people for their jobs so the third the third um the third question you can ask people for their jobs is what do you want to be when you grow up you can be a fireman a cook a baker a painter or anything else that you dream and you want to be so the word dream is in the next sentence we're going to talk about what do you dream to be in or what do you dream to be in when you are a grown-up i dream to be an astronaut when I'm a grown-up or when I'm an adult so those are how you could you could you could ask when you ask about jobs now we're gonna talk about these simple words and they're on my side we have the pictures that I printed on the printer I, I will make sure that they don't fall because they're in order. Let me get them in order. There. Now they're in order. So the first word we're going to pronunciate and the word you need to pronunciate and read along with me, you have to do that. So you can pronunciate the words very easily and go to America, just like my dream in some of my writings or my or my tip notes so now the first word is teacher repeat after me teacher get the marker teacher 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 who is a teacher a teacher is a person who teaches students she teaches the students at school and here is the picture of the teacher. 
you can see that she's teaching the alphabet A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, S, Y, and Z. Now you know the tune. Uh, just like that. So it's a very simple song. But at the back, we have a butterfly. Hmm, don't care about it. So we'll put the picture of the teacher on the side. I'll bring up my marker, and the next word we're going to talk about is doctor, 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 doctor. Wait, I'll get something to put it on the, on the picture so it doesn't fall off. Now let's pronounce the read along with me. Doctor, doctor, and what is a doctor? A doctor is a person who takes care of you when you are sick. They give, a sh give you a shock in here, and sometimes when you're a baby, they give a shock in here. So, that's what a doctor will do. And the doctor works at the hospital. Pronunciate with me. Hospital. Hospital. So, now, maybe we have another job right there, but I don't think it is a job, but maybe um, that isn't a job. It's not a job, not anything. So, now, let's just go on with our vocabulary. Now, the third word we're going to talk about is vet about long huh vet vet <laughs> um read along with me vet vet who is a vet let me take this picture out of the way a vet is a person who takes care of your pets like i have a fish and then my fish is hungry. I throw it some food, but it doesn't eat. So I bring it to the vet, and the vet will take care of the fish until it's well. And then I take the fish home. So where does the vet work? The vet works at the same place as a dentist work. But the vet is not a... Um, 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 a dentist, it, he is or she is a vet. A vet works at a vet's clinic. And a dentist works at a dentist's clinic. That's how you separate them. Then we have a cook. Uh, read along with me. Cook. 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 So it is a cook. A cook is a person who cooks food. Let me take this picture out of the way. The cook is a person who cooks food. So that is called, um, that is called a cook. A cook is a person who just likes cooks food. Let me take away this, 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 this. And now I'm just going to show you the picture. The cook works in a restaurant. This is a cook. And on the back is a snake and it's a um, baby. So now I'll put the cook aside. I'm going to color it under. And now let's do the next word. The next word is fireman. Who is a fireman? A fireman is a person who put out fires. Pronu uh, read along with me. Fireman. Fireman. Repeat after me. Repeat after me. Like this shape. A circle. And then, just like, you just need a circle and you need this point. So you need that. You go around. That means to repeat. So it's a fireman. A fireman.
and works at a fire station. And here is the picture of the fireman. And at the back, it's a hairdresser, but it's not a good hairdresser because it's a little um, shady. It's shady. This cook is also shady. And at the back, we have a singer for this and it has the word coloring pages. So it's a singer. And this is a fire. Let's put it aside. So we'll excellent fireman. And now we have a baker. A baker is a person who bakes things. It's a baker. A baker. A baker. A baker works at a bakery. Repeat after me. A bakery. And a baker does a thing that helps you. He gives you goods. And those goods are mainly called <coughs> bread and milk. And now we'll fix away baker. Now we have singer. Let me put up this. My favorite picture. It's a singer. A singer. A singer. A singer. A singer. We paid after me. A singer. 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 A singer is a person who sings songs. This is my most favorite picture. It's about a singer. This is the curtain, this is the radio, and she is singing. She is singing with the microphone. Like, you left the went to space. I don't recognize this place. Where are you? That's the song of Happy For You from the most popular singer in Canada, Lucas Graham. He has lots of famous songs, like, um, Someone you love, or, or any other song, and they have a Lego piece here. This is the dragon that we just built, and it can be stuck right here. The art and then moved. This is the hand. This is the arms. <clears throat> and I also need to add a hand right here to hold the gun. So, now we're going to talk about the word painter, 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 repeat after me, painter, 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 painter. Painter, painter, painter. A painter is a person who paints pictures. It's a painter. A painter works at just like a place uh, works all around the world. And this is a famous painter. Ouch! So I'll put the painter and the word actress aside. And then, we'll move on with this. Who is this? This is a butcher. And, and here, we have a lion. Can you see this big, angry lion? It has sharp teeth. And this is its lips. This is its mouth. I'm coloring it with, uh, just like, I'm coloring it using oil pastel so it can be true. So it's a butcher. 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 It's 
a butcher. It's a butcher. It's a butcher. So it is a butcher. A butcher is a person who sells, who just like to works. So a butcher is a person who works in a meat shop. He works in a meat shop. What is a meat shop? Just like he cuts out meat and sells the meat. Now we're going to move to dentist. Dentist is a person who works in a dentist's clinic. The dentist will fix your teeth. Ow! Ow, 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 ow! If you run home, bring your teeth, go to bed, and then blood goes out, and then one day you die. <laughs> I'm just joking, but you don't die from a dentist's workshop. It's just a dream. Now, we're gonna talk about an astronaut. Look at this astronaut. He's, um, he's holding, um, just like, this astronaut is holding the gears. He's controlling him. Just like he wants to go to the left. Here we have the word astronaut. I'm ready to go for you. Astronaut, 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 as, 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 astronaut. Astronauts work in space and they explore space. They explore space, but they do not do anything but exploring space. And the main place where they work is in a space shuttle. And the most, um, just like the most useless place where they work is space. They just go out for a little while, they have a tank, and then think, 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 think. Like if a thing breaks out, like a like a light, then they go out and tap the lights and put them together, get some new things, and then get a hammer and and another and then you finish the thing. The broken place. Now we're gonna talk about a dentist. Dentist is a person who works in a another job it's a cashier but I don't think a cashier is a job maybe we don't have the word maybe we don't have the word um, waitress Phew, let me find it oops so things broken the word waitress is behind the word teacher <laughs> so the word waitress is behind the word teacher. So, let's talk about this. Um, let me see. This is a waiter. The waiter is, um, is, um, the waiter is a person who, who gives food and he is a male. A waitress is a person who also serves food. But she is a female. So those what and the wait the waiters and the waitresses will are all females and males. They will work in the same restaurants. Some work in the same restaurants and the wives or other people. You see. Is a person who 
person who cuts hair. He cuts my hair, and I am now cooler. A same thing for a hairdresser. A hairdresser also cuts my hair, but is a female. So a barber is a male, and a and the hairdresser is a female. They do the same thing, cutting their hair, but they're different from uh, people that are men and people that are women or male and female. There are lots of kinds of people, not only males in the in the earth, but certainly true that there are more males than females on earth. It's true. Don't say it's false. Don't say it's false, but it's true. But we don't care about it because we're talking about this simple lesson of about, as you know, it is about jobs. So now, where is it? There. I'll get my marker. I'll cross out whiter, armor, and hairdresser. Now let's do the policeman. Who is a policeman? Oops. It's oil pastels. Let me wave away my sweat. This is a policeman. A policeman is a person who protects us. He looks like he has a smile. And he drives a police car. The policeman is a person who drives a police car and he protects us. And his main job is to work at the police station and discover thieves and ask suspects. Just like says, someone said, someone stole my suitcases. And then I, and then he said that um, someone with um, someone with a black mask to drove away in a red car. Then the police will find the suspect and then just look at it. So now let's cross away police and, and move into artists. Let me take away from this man. We've almost finished all the words that we cross away wages to. And the next word about here, let me see. And the next word is artist. It's different from painter. So don't get confused with it. It's not a painter, it's an artist. It's an artist, not a painter, but it's an artist. An artist is a person who paints pictures. He paints beautiful pictures. It's not like a painter who just likes scrabble paint, shin, 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 shin on the walls, but, uh, he is the person who, who paints pictures. He paints beautiful pictures. Let me see, the cameraman is here. Oops, the cameraman dropped the camera. So, let me see if he can fix it. There, now the cameraman. So, this suspect is finished. Let's cross away artist and we'll move on with builder a builder is a person who builds houses look at this magnificent builder he is building a house and he is using concrete first he's making a small design of the house then he will use concrete to build up the house and then he will also use concrete in the main house. Here, maybe he's just making a model so he could build a big house. But we don't care about it. The builder builds houses 
and his main place for him to work is at the construction site, but he goes he goes home in the evening or in the afternoon. Now, let's let's read the word builder with me. But builder, builder, build, builder. Repeat after me. Builder. Builder. So now, this is a builder. I also drew this builder, but I did this. Here. And now, let's cross away builder. And then, we'll have dancer. This lady is dancing. She is called a dancer. A dancer dances. I'm not a pretty good dancer, but this is just a dance. But here it has a hairdresser. Um, this um, this is a this lesson is a little crazy because suddenly I found a barber, but I found hairdresser on the back of the word teacher. Oops. I forgot everything. I forgot to put them in order. I forgot to put them in order. So I don't think that's it. So the hairdress, I mean the the dancer dances at a ball. Dances at a ball or dances even at a castle. Like the golden tower on the next place of my house. They're building it. It looks very shiny outside but it looks dirty and roughy inside. It's almost finished by the builders, what we just said, but it's not really finished. So, we'll cross away, dancer. Now we've done all of our words about jobs. So, I hope you like this video. If you want to watch more of my videos about vocabulary, make sure that you write my website. My website is learning vocabularies about jobs with Tommy. I know you pronounce, know how to pronounce it. Tommy, Tommy. Hmm. Oh, that's crazy. So now, goodbye and take care. See you next time.